Well, we're in the season of giving, and for some, there could be no better present than the gift of time. To help them keep aging well, KITV 4's Diana Ko tells us how we can show our kupuna a little love to help chase away the holiday blues. Mandy, as the months go by and coronavirus continues to be a huge and pressing issue, how is this impacting senior citizens' mental health? You know, a lot of our seniors are being negatively impacted by COVID because maybe their community networks, if they were going out to community day centers, adult daycare programs, church, um, they're no longer able to do that. And sometimes even family members are isolating themselves from these seniors to keep them protected. Mandy Kiaha is a nurse who works at CareSift, a long-term care placement service. She says since the coronavirus hit, her agency has been getting more calls because seniors are getting depressed and their health is declining. The, the number one reason why people do seek care is dementia, um, which is, you know, can be worsened through social isolation and lack of stimulation. So with such a high prevalence, I would say, of dementia in our population, and given that Hawaii does have one of the oldest, older population of seniors, um, it can only be assumed that we're going to see probably um, higher rates of hospitalizations, faster decline, cognitive, uh, I think dementia will also progress a little faster, so people will need care sooner. How can we take care of our seniors? Zoom classes are great if seniors have access to an aptitude for technology. But Kiaha says we can check in on a senior we know whether or not they're family. Telephone calls would be great um, visits. You know, I think a lot of people have to take on the community responsibility of checking in on their neighbors. What can the seniors do for themselves? Seniors, at this point, and I think it's important for them to understand their resources and understand that they're not alone. She's very worried about this group. This, you know, this population really has a special place in my heart, and I think it's our duty as the younger generation to be able to take care of them because they are the link to our past. They're taking care of us. Kiahal points out the coronavirus is forcing us to change our patterns and perspective. It's not about money and our daily job. It's about taking care of each other and loving each other. And I think this is giving us a new take on life, and I hope that it continues beyond COVID. Diana Ko, KITV4 Island News.